Hello friends, my name is Surreal O'Meal and welcome back to some more Need for Speed Carb and today we are going to be doing the boss race against Wolf, so let's get straight into it. You made me wait. I'm just surprised you were stupid enough to show up at all. Them wolves are be howling, so let's get straight onto it. Apparently I got perfect launch there. Anyways, um, so, not gonna lie, uh, I just did this event about, uh, about <laughs> eight minutes ago. And yeah, uh, I went to go and do the uh, the reward bits at the end of the boss battles, and it turns out his car wasn't where I expected it to be. So we're starting over again, but that doesn't matter. Uh, what does matter is the fact that this Renault is now super super quick. And what's happened is basically uh, between the this episode and uh, the last episode, I actually tried to do some of those defensive races. The issue is, apparently now that we've got a fully upgraded tier 2 car, or it might be because of how far we are into the game, uh, I'm actually uh, getting put against tier 3 cars, um, such as Dodge Vipers and Mitsubishi Evos, and as much as I love me little Renault, it, it can't compete. <laughs> it just cannot compete with a Dodge Viper or a, a Mitsubishi Evo or a Subaru STI or anything like that, so... Yeah, both me and me a crewmate, we just decided to back off on that one. Probably for the best. Apparently Wolf is kicking my ass in this one, which is just peachy. Uh, I did check, uh, I did redid all the performance mods because apparently he didn't save, but that's fair enough. Uh, I, we only bought like two mods because it's the only two mods we had left to buy for this vehicle, so yay. Anyways, uh, he's going to not use the shortcut, so we'll use that to our advantage. I don't get why he took the tunnel one, to be honest with you. Usually they don't take the uh, tunnel shortcuts. He seems incredibly confused now, um, <laughs> even though he used it just a second ago on that uh, other lap. And apparently he's crashed into something as well, or he must have done, because I don't know how anyone falls that far behind, uh, having not crashed. Apparently he's like six seconds behind us now. And apparently you saw that. It's actually kind of clever the way they done that. Uh, I was actually, I'll have to upload it maybe to my second channel. Uh, apparently he's now 12 seconds behind, what the hell. Anyways, uh, on the collector's edition of this game you've got like a little disc DVD which shows you how they made the game and stuff. And this, like the facial motion capture flat was actually kind of clever. Uh, especially considering this game was like made in 2006. Uh, it's quite clever. Of course in the PlayStation 2 version of the game you don't have that. Uh, you just have talking cars essentially, which is fair enough. Um, that's how I thought the game was, that's when I got a bit creeped out when I saw the fact that like, actual faces were in vehicles on this game. It seemed a little bit odd, but there you go. Anyways, across the line for the Breno Clio. As we get 15,000, and now to the canyons. Right, let's let's go. Let's see how the Renault can do in the canyons. Uh, I kind of know how this works. Um, the last time I did, the, well, actually, I'm not going to ruin it for you. But uh, let's just say the Renault's pretty decent in the canyons. It's a tuna car. Uh, tuna's probably my favourite class for taking to the canyons, but it's also the hardest to like win on the first round with. They're the best for the first round, and then oh, sorry. Ooh, okay, maybe we're going to pass him. We're going to pass him. Can we? Can we do it? Can we clutch it? Oh no! No, no, no! Bollocks! We just missed out on it. Oh, maybe not. Maybe he's gonna make a mistake. Uh, maybe we will actually clinch this, believe it or not. Will this be the shortest Let's Play episode in history? The answer is, yes it will. 4 minutes 48 seconds and he's already dead. <laughs> Excellent. Let 
let you win. Right, can I get these bloody cards right? Right, maybe it'll be the third one and the second one. That's the ones I'm going for. Yes, pink slip, excellent. Okay, I, I don't have to care about this anymore. So, luckily, uh, we don't have to do the uh, the cards anymore. That's it for the cards. We don't have to do those anymore because... Uh, hey, that was a great race. You think you could use another flyer? Meet me at the university. Let's talk. Alright, let's go and meet Colin. Anyways, yeah. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> we don't have to do any more of them reward card things anymore, which is good. That means uh, I don't have to gamble on getting bosses' cars and stuff. That one, that probably shouldn't have happened. Uh, I don't know why it was in that one, because all the other times I've played this game, all the boss cars have like stayed in exactly the same place, so I have no idea why it's different on this time round, but it is. So, yeah, uh, that's something interesting. In case you're wondering... Oh, actually, I'll uh, shut up, because cutscene. Look, I just want to race. That's all I ever wanted. If you're still looking to make good on the past, I might be able to help you with that, too. It was a big night you left. It got pretty crazy, real quick. I was playing it cool. Then I see Nikki knocked down. I could have sworn that the guy who knocked it down had the same bag. I can help you guys out. I'm one of the best drivers in this city and you know it. Okay, right, we are going to do that, but we are going to do that in the next episode after this one. Uh, two quick things I do want to say. A, how unashamedly crap is that guy's intro? It's it's amazing. And secondly, a uh, fun fact about Colin is his actor is actually the body actor of the player. So in like Most Wanted and Carp, and when you get arrested, you see your guy get flown around and stuff. Apparently, uh, Colin is actually the actor that does all of that stuff as well, so that's pretty cool. Anyways, um, that's it for this episode. We're going to go meet Darius in the next episode because it kind of leads to the next part of the game. And this is only really supposed to be the um, sort of takeover of Fortuna. So yeah, we'll, uh, we'll leave that till the next episode. Anyways, I want to thank you all very much for watching. I've just been The Real Emil. Until next time, farewell. <laughs>